about the fact that it's just... Being a famous TikTok personality means that all eyes are on you, so it is very important to reflect the best to the public and be a role model for fans. However, some TikTokers don't understand what the consequences of acting rude and irresponsible are. These consequences were lived by famous TikToker Charlie D'Amelio, where she recently lost over 1 million followers just for a shocking statement she made about her fans and the embarrassing way her family treated James Charles. So, make sure you stick around for this video as we look at how Charlie D'Amelio lost 1 million followers in only 24 hours. But first, a simple reminder on how to enter our brand new giveaway. We're giving away either an iPhone X Max, the new iPad mini, or a MacBook Pro. It's all your choice, so be sure to leave a like, comment the keyword, subscribe, and turn on notifications to enter this giveaway. It's really that simple. First, how did all the drama start? The D'Amelios have a long history of success and have made countless appearances on various shows. They even have their own YouTube channel called The D'Amelio Family. That is something similar to Keeping Up with the Kardashians, but slightly less budgeted. Here, the family posts various videos of what they do. Recently, in 2020, they came up with the idea of releasing a new chain of episodes called Dinner with the D'Amelios. The short-lasting series showed the D'Amelios eating dinner along with a famous personality that would be a surprise, up until the moment the whole family was sitting at the table. In November of 2020, they posted one of their episodes on YouTube with the celebrity joining them being James Charles, the famous beauty YouTuber. The family and guests would all eat a delicious dinner prepared by their personal chef, Aaron May, and would continue talking about interesting things they did in their past. However, even though dinner took off with a good start, it ended up making a huge turnaround, where both viewers and James felt a sense of discomfort with the way the D'Amelios would act. Dixie, Charlie's sister, was pointed out by fans as being the rudest and most immature person at the dinner table. Even though she is older than her sister Charlie, aged almost 20, you could have never guessed it by the video. She received a lot of backlash from fans for ignoring the family guests and instead spent her time picking on her nails and occasionally responding only to her sister Charlie. As well, she would find ways to get the attention all to herself, going as far as throwing up in front of the cameras. As soon as James came into the room, he was called out for not being famous enough. At the very beginning of the series, the D'Amelio sat down and were looking looking rather excited about who was going to be their guest on their premiere episode. All of them started guessing who the celebrity joining them would be, when all of a sudden James Charles made a bright and energetic appearance, greeting everyone, including the adorable family dog. Not too soon after, Charlie's mom, who didn't really look that surprised, told James that she was expecting someone more famous. Like, if James Charles isn't already one of the most famous global internet personalities, not wanting to appear too harsh, she then tried to cover up what she she said by adding that what she meant was that she was expecting a famous celebrity whom she didn't already know. Like that makes any sense at all. James surprisingly took the whole thing with a smile on his face and tried to spark up the mood by following along with the conversation. Dixie made a big dramatic scene when she ate a snail but didn't mind eating her own booger afterward. Um, weird. Now, this is where dinner with the D'Amelios really started going downhill. When James finally was the main focus at the dinner table, Dixie started staring weirdly at a snail she picked from her plate. This caught the whole family's attention except for James, who, at the moment, was still talking. Not too long passed when the D'Amelios started laughing with each other and left James confused and slightly discomforted. Of course, who wouldn't be confused if they were in James's shoes? The YouTuber then politely stopped and asked why everyone was laughing and turned to Dixie. Since Dixie saw the attention was all on her, she figured out that it was finally her time to shine. So, she started it off by complaining that the snail was disgusting and tasted gross while their personal chef was right in front of them. The poor chef, who in a very awkward position, tried to laugh it off and told the girl that eating snails represented good luck. This wasn't enough for Dixie. She continued to be even more dramatic and started gagging while she got up from the dinner table and ran outside to vomit. After she calmed down from the snail she ate, she would leave viewers laughing their eyes out. Later on, she was caught secretly picking her nose and moments after, she licked the same finger. I guess those chunky 
salty boogers were a much better treat for Dixie rather than that luxurious meal she had in front of her. It's all the attention on me. The D'Amelio sisters would not care what James would say and preferred talking about themselves. Of course, Dixie is not the only one to be called out for her immature attention-seeking behavior. It was Charlie too. During the dinner, she would start a conversation where she would talk about herself and her past experiences. Sure, James was trying to engage with her and would try to relate, only to be completely ignored and given no importance of what he said. Charlie would usually stop for a moment to listen to what James had to say, then just continue the conversation where she left it. This made the viewers feel secondhand embarrassed. Just imagine how James might have felt at that moment. Both the sisters didn't even make the slightest effort to get to know James Charles, who, not to forget, was the main guest of the show. It's like going to the Ellen DeGeneres show and Ellen just starts talking about herself. Wouldn't that be so weird? In fact, the girls were called out for acting like total brats by not even making eye contact with James when they were talking, and instead picking their nails throughout the whole episode and acting like total eight-year-olds. Charlie expressed clearly that she sees her fans as just numbers, not really as individuals. Charlie has reached almost 100 million followers on TikTok in just one year after hitting her first 1 million viewers. No doubt, she is such an entertainer and often leaves fans with goosebumps after uploading a video of herself dancing. But as we all know, not one would become famous without the support of each other and every amazing fan, no matter the talent a person holds. To maintain fame, celebrities should always respect fans and find ways to make them feel appreciated. This is the opposite of what Charlie did in the episode of Dinner with the D'Amelios. When she was discussing her TikTok followers with James, Charlie said that she wasn't fully satisfied with the number she had reached on TikTok and that she wished she would have reached a full 100 million. James then tried to make her be thankful for what she had, but there was no way Charlie would listen. After the video was uploaded on YouTube, fans were furious and disappointed to find out that someone they had been viewing as their role model is someone that sees fans as a number rather than real people. With this being said, thousands of fans started unfollowing Charlie minutes after the video of her saying that was uploaded. In the outro, James ironically said, this is probably the last dinner with James Charles and the D'Amelios. The end of this awkward and horrible episode needed to come somehow. And like most shows, a professional outro needed to be done. In the beginning, Dixie just shouted that this was the end of the episode and seemed as she was impatiently waiting for the cameras to shut down. Thankfully for the D'Amelios, James would save them by making an outro for the episode. The YouTuber even credited the personal chef for his amazing dishes and then ironically stated that this must be the last dinner all of them have together. But it would have just been better if he would have ended the show by saying, this is the first episode of Dinner with the D'Amelios and also the last episode of the Dinner with the D'Amelios. Because there might never be another release of the series after the girl's scandalous attitude. How did Charlie react to what happened? Following the backlash, D'Amelio lost over 1 million followers on TikTok in less than 24 hours. After a few days of the video being posted, she made an Instagram Live video where she apologized for her behavior and her sister's behavior also. However, she still tried to blame her fans for misinterpreting the whole event by saying that they could hate and unfollow all they want. But it's not fair that all of this is happening to her just because of a big misunderstanding. Her apology video didn't really make any difference. In fact, it might have made matters worse by getting double the violent threat she was receiving after the release of the Dinner with the D'Amelios episode. Many defended the girls after the video, including James Charles, where he stated that both girls are great and fun to be around. Charlie and Dixie are both amazing and talented young girls, and they should be appreciated for the effort and hard work they put into entertaining their audience. Keeping in mind that they are just age 16 and 19 should make viewers realize that they are too young to handle threats and online bullying. People make mistakes, and these girls are just in front of a huge audience all of the time, so it might leave them exhausted or stressed out. Unfollowing Charlie and Dixie are enough to teach them a lesson, but bullying them is not an answer. And with that being said, it wraps up this video. Thanks for watching.